Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you three ways to use audio in Google Slides. I've been getting a lot of questions about this lately, so let's take a look. First up, the first way that you can add audio to Google Slides is a relatively new option. That's in your insert menu in Google Slides. You have the option to insert audio into any one of your slides. So I select that audio. Now the catch of this is that your audio has to be stored in your Google Drive already. So I'll select that one that I have in my Google Drive. And now you'll see it's added a little play button that I can drag around the screen. I can put it up there. And over here we have our format options. I can loop that audio. I can have that audio start playing automatically when I launch my slides full screen. I can close that up. Now the trouble with this is that I have to add it to every single slide. The other problem, the other tricky part of this, is that I need to record that audio in a separate tool, then upload it to Google Drive. So to do that, I'll use onlinevoicerecorder.com. I'll do a quick recording. Maybe I'll do a recording about this slide here. This is a picture of my house last Friday morning after a big, heavy, wet snowstorm that knocked out the power to a third of my county. And you can see here, I can trim this down. And now I'll save it. And that'll save as an MP3 right on my desktop. But now I have to upload that to my drive. So let's get that audio that I just created. There it is. So there's my audio recording that I've just uploaded. And now I can go back to my Google Drive, insert it using that audio. And now I have that little button. And again, I'm gonna have that play automatically. So that process is a little bit cumbersome if you are trying to add narration to every single one of your slides. Now, if you're just trying to add in some music in the background, not a big deal. You can just upload some audio files that you have and away you go. But if you're trying to do narration for every slide, well, this process could get a little, little cumbersome. So there's another way that I recommend trying to use audio with Google Slides if you're trying to create narration for your slides. And that is to simply use a screencasting tool and record yourself talking over your slides while you're presenting them. Now the tool that I'd recommend for most people who are using Google Slides already is to use Screencastify. Let's take a look at how Screencastify works. So here I have my Screencastify button, a little extension, and I'm gonna record my desktop. You can also record with your webcam enabled if you like. I have my microphone set and let's record. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to record my whole screen while my slides are in full screen mode. This is my amazing sample slide presentation made by the Sample King. Let's take a look at all the slides, which include this nice picture of my front yard after a big snowstorm last Friday. And here's a picture of me and three friends after finishing a 200 mile single day bike ride. That's the end of my slides. So now I'll stop sharing. And I'm gonna have my little playback here. Now uh, you can see here, I've muted the playback. Let's just call this one now, sample slides presentation. 
And you can see here, I can share that directly to my Google Classroom or publish it to YouTube or even download it as a video file to save on my computer. Probably the easiest way is to just hit share to Google Classroom. So that's the second way that you might approach using audio with Google Slides. Now the third option is one that I've shared in the past, and that is to use a video that you found on YouTube that plays music and hide it in the background of your slide. Let's see how that looks. So here we have my slide, and let's say I wanna use Beethoven's Fifth Symphony as a background music. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to now insert a video put in the URL for it. I'm gonna make it really small. I'm going to enable autoplay when presenting. So when it goes full screen and we get to this slide, it's automatically going to start playing. And I'll just move my picture over top of it. There we go. So it'll just be kind of hidden down there really small so that people don't really notice it when I go to play it. So that's three ways that you can use audio in your Google Slides. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube